hey this will be a video chart on ALTO before I get started I should note that this is a 60 minute chart we're like looking at meaning each one of these bars or candlesticks as they're called is 60 minutes worth of price action as opposed to uh, the normal you'd see a daily chart so each one of these would be one day in this case you can see the days are much further spread apart and that is because each one of these candlesticks is just 60 minutes worth of price action so I did this one a couple of days ago and it uh, skyrocketed out of the gates and then to, by the end of the day had this big profit taking uh, but after today it has held up it looks like it's uh, found a bottom for now and uh, did basically consolidating today so we'll have to see what uh, you know goes on the rest of this week but just to go over kind of a quick recap you know obviously the uh, chart started to come to life here with all this volume and then you know the huge day or excuse me not day the huge uh, period of time right here where not only did it gap up right there you can see it then was off to the races and really started running but then this is where the profit takers stepped in uh, tried to get back up through there quite a few times but just couldn't quite do it and then pulled back and fell back to this area now this actually makes a great example because the last time I did this uh, this area right here was a resistance that's why it's red but when it gapped up and then made a move above it like that that's where this became an area of support so let me get that change to green because that is the first update and then like I was saying with in terms of the example when it did come back down here look at how this area is now doing a good job of providing support uh, so this is just a, a great real life example of a resistance being turned into support and then when the price comes back down to back test it it does a good job of holding as support so that is going to be the key level that uh, you'll want to continue to watch is going to be this level here at uh, right around 0.026 uh, like I've been pointing out it's been back tested and has proven to be uh, a significant level where the bulls are hanging out down here and are willing to buy shares and if this chart is going to be able to you know push up to new highs and get through four and a half cents uh, then this level down here is going to need to continue to hold uh, but in the last portion of the day last couple hours you can see it did start to head back up so where are the resistance levels that the bulls will encounter on the way back up and the one that's sticking out right now is going to be right here and I'll explain why that is in just a second let me get this changed to red for resistance now if we go back through the history you can see that with this big move it came back and look how many times it bounced off this level as support you know it did it once twice three times and then right there closed right at it and then when the price did fall through it looked what happened on that next candle this candle tried to get back up above it but could not so this is yet another example of a support turning into a resistance so this level right here at 0.036 is going to be the first hurdle to cross if this current like miniature bounce here is going to continue uh, after 0.036 the next area of resistance isn't until up here at this area where the price tried to get through uh, yesterday and so forth and this area is right here right around the 0.044 uh, 5 area give or take a little bit you can see some candles hit exactly it others went a little bit above it and then other candles went a little bit below it so just kind of finding a common ground there and this will be the extra important resistance will so make that a little thicker because that would then propel the chart into higher high so that is where the chart currently stands so far so good with the 0.026 holding and uh, with the rest of this week or maybe even tomorrow we'll see if the bulls can make pushes back up above these resistance levels here if there are any other questions on the chart uh, please let me know if not I'd encourage you to check out bullwarriorstocks.com if you go there and sign up for the free newsletter you'll be sent a free ebook and with their newsletter subscription, you'll get charts, setups, trade ideas, educational pieces, all sorts of things from penny stocks up to big boards. So there's a good variety, something for everybody. It is all free. We've been making some good money together with our alerts. So I'd encourage you to go to the website, sign up, and give it a try. One more time, this was ALTO. Thanks for listening.